Good morning and welcome to Beep It Live. It's Monday. So what does that mean, Roy? It's what? Oh, it means Motivation Monday. All right. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what do you have in store for us today? Uh-oh, did we lose? All Roy? right. I'm, I'm here, Leah. I'm here. I was so excited. All the buttons got pushed. Um, <laughs> no, so we have a lot in store today. Uh, once again, we are building off of the previous weeks and we are moving into our almost fall season, nice and strong on our solid fundamentals here. So we're hitting our lower body. We have some isometric holds with uh, core stability. Um, we have high plank rows that we're going to be working in as well as some kneeling weighted lifts. And I'll go through, all, I'll demonstrate all of these movements uh, before we get to work. Uh, so. But once again, let me welcome uh, Sergeant Barry. How are you? Yeah, good morning. I'm doing well. A little sore this morning, but it shouldn't affect me. <laughs> All right. I Perfect. think that means go easy on her, Roy. <laughs> we sure will. The, the, the great thing about this uh, program, this programmed exercise, is that we're working against our clock. So we're not working for reps. We're not working for speed. We're working at our own pace, and we're able to go at our own pace. So if you're just new, if you're just joining us, welcome to Be Fit Live Motivation Monday here. So we are going to run through four exercises for 40 seconds on and 20 seconds of rest. Again, 40, 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest. That's going to be four rounds of four exercises. And in between each round, we are going to get one minute of rest to rehydrate, to towel off, to refocus and prepare for our next round. So again, four rounds, 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest. If you're just joining us, let's go ahead and uh, get your gear. I hope you have some comfortable shoes on. We're gonna get to work, grab that towel and water, and we will go through some dynamic stretching before we get started. And then uh, I'm going to demonstrate the exercises for you right now uh, that we have in store to tackle. And then we'll move into our dynamic stretching and right into work. So, we are going through four exercises again. Split hops is gonna be our first exercise. Here's a, a couple of cues here. So we are familiar with our split stance here. And just like our, our, our previous segments here, split stance is where you want to be. And we are gonna work on a little bit of power here. So split hops is gonna be our exercise number one. 20 seconds each leg. So 20 seconds with your front, your left leg forward and 20 seconds with your right leg forward and it's going to look like this. We are down in a lunge and we're just going to power hop up. So you wanna get a lot of your drive from your quad here. So you're gonna feel a lot of drive through your quad and activate that glute and hamstring. So you feel a lot of lower body power here. So we're just working on a little bit of a hop to gain that, to utilize those fast switch muscle fibers and get a little bit of power in, okay? So that's gonna be exercise number one. Exercise number two here is a kneeling weighted lift. No, no worries here. You do, if you don't have any weight, that's perfectly fine, okay? So no, no weight here. We are going to bring our hands together. We're gonna to take a half kneel stance. So my right knee is up, my left knee is down. I am keeping my arms as straight as can be here from the lower right across my body up to the upper left here. We are going to reverse chop and you'll feel your core try to stabilize. You'll feel your glutes activating. You'll feel your ankles, your knees, your calves. Try and stabilize here. So nice and smooth at your own pace, okay? That's gonna be exercise number two and number four. Number four is gonna be, again, your right leg is up, your left knee is down and we are going to reverse chop here, okay? A couple of cues here, your arms as straight as can be. Really engage your core and your glutes here, okay? Keep them nice and tight, nice and activated, and let's come at your own pace. Go at your own pace, and you'll feel a lot of work here in your core and in your obliques. Your third exercise is going to be body weight high plank rows. So we've done, we've done high planks before, we've done rows before. Let's combine the two as if they weren't challenging enough. So we're gonna get down in a high plank position. Let me see if you can see me here. And we are just gonna slowly 
row here, nice and smooth, really focusing on the contract at the top, okay? You really wanna focus on that row, okay? And if this is um, too challenging, let's go ahead and regress here to our knees and just focus on, focusing on that row, okay? And again, we wanna keep our core nice and tight, nice and engaged, our glutes nice and activated and focusing on a nice controlled movement here. Form, uh, form, proper form, again, it should be a, your top priority here. So those are gonna be the four exercises for today. Split hops, kneeling weighted lifts, body weight high plank rows, and again, kneeling, weight, kneeling weighted lifts. If you have weight, if you do not, again, just your, just your own body weight is fine to stabilize. That would be perfect, that would be enough, trust me. Okay, so let's go into some dynamic stretching and then we'll go into our work. Let me go ahead and towel off here. And again, if you're just joining us, we're going through 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, four rounds for our Motivation Monday Be Fit Live, okay? Just like every workout, we're gonna start off with some dynamic stretching here. We're looking to stretch and warm up as many muscle groups as possible to get ready to put in the work here. So let's go with dynamic quad stretch. So we're gonna grab, I'm going with my left leg. I'm quad stretching, but I'm also gonna raise that right arm all the way up to the top. Nice long stretch here with your right hand up. And let's alternate at your own pace. And we're gonna, we're gonna work these about 30 seconds each movement here. So. Again, I'm losing my balance, but that means my core needs to wake up. My body needs to wake up and we need to focus on getting to work here. <laughs> Again, dynamic quad stretch here. About two more to go, two more left. One more here. Nice long stretch. Okay, let's go into reverse lunge reaches here. We're gonna stand at the top here my right leg is going all the way back here. I'm reverse lunging down and my right arm is reaching all the way over the top across my body here. I'll come back up to the top. Left leg is going all the way back and my left arm is reaching all the way over here. About 30 seconds of work here at your own pace. Nice long stretch here. You should feel a lot of your hip flexors, your quads, your glutes. We're getting some blood flow to these muscle groups and stretching out areas that we are going to work today here to make us as flexible, as mobile as possible. Again, my legs are already, <laughs> already feeling the, the blood flow here. All right. All right, let's go up top here. We have some shoulder work that we're gonna do. So let's roll out our shoulders. Let's start small arm circles here. And let's go a little bit wider and wider to your comfort here. Again, shoulder mobility and let's reverse. Starting small here, I'm reversing shoulder circles. Nice and big. All right, good. Let's take a nice wide stance here. We are going to go left to right with alternating fixed lateral lunges here. So we are just going to keep our hands on our quads and ski back and forth here. Really, the name of the game is opening up our hips, getting some blood flow to our legs, to our glutes, to our inner thighs here. Should be nice and smooth, nothing too challenging here. Nice. All right. Five more seconds. Four, three, one. Good. Okay. Let's go into some hinge reaches. Our last dynamic stretch here. My feet are inside of shoulder width apart. My hands are up. Nice and tall here. I'm hinging at the hips. About 45 degrees here. Hands directly over my head. And I'm back up to the top here. So hinge. Uh, 45 degrees here, and I'm back up at the top. Note here that your knees should have a soft bend in them. 
Feel that stretch in your hamstring, your lower back, your shoulders should be getting some blood flow and some work in. Three more here. Two. One. All right, good work. All right, I'm gonna towel off, grab some water, start my timer and let's get to work. Sorry, that stretching felt really good. Can we just do a stretch session instead? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'll, I'll, bring, I'll bring my foam roller out next time and we can just do an on the floor, an on the floor session. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know mobility and recovery is just as important as our as our nice strong workouts so think about recovery being just as important fitting time in for recovery should be just as important as your workouts here so great note Sergeant Barry all right split <laughs> split hops okay split hops are our first exercises 20 seconds each leg we're going to start in 10 here again split stance my left leg is forward my right leg is back and we are going to be hopping here in four, three, two, one. All right, here we go here. Split stance, hops. Let's focus on driving through that heel again. Here we go. 10 more seconds on this left leg. Your hips are down. You should feel that burn in your quad, two, one. All right, let's alternate here. Right leg's forward, left leg is back. Nice and steady, nice and slow. Let's work on our balance. <laughs> work on our stabilization here. A little bit of power through that heel. Use those arms if you need. And time. Ooh, oh, nice yeah. burn, nice burn. All right, kneeling weighted lifts in 10, all right. First round, we'll learn it. Second round, we'll own it, okay? My left leg. <laughs> my left knee is down. Let's go left knee down, right knee up. And I'm coming across my body right now, okay? Let's go ahead and work here. So right knee is up, left knee is down. I'm at a half kneeling stance. Let me take a little bit more of a profile view here so you can see. I'm keeping my arms as straight as possible. And with that split knee stance, it's forcing my body to stabilize, counterbalance, I'm using my obliques, we're using our anterior delts, our front of our shoulders, our lower back for that high extension. Two, one, and time. 40 seconds of work flies by when you're having fun. <laughs> <laughs> Body weight high planks are up next. All right, we get positioned here. Okay. Body weight high planks, uh, high plank position. In three, two, one. Okay, let's work. Keep that core nice and tight, nice and engaged. And let's move at our own pace, okay? If we need to drop down to our knees here, that's perfectly fine. And if you need a little bit more support, go ahead and take that wider foot stance, more than shoulder width apart, and that will help you stabilize at those up top rows, okay? All right, really focus on that top portion of the row. With body weight, you wanna really focus on contracting your lats here. Two, one, and time. All right, good work, good work. All right, our final set for this first round. My right knee is down, my left knee is up, weighted, kneeling lifts here. So again, I'm coming from the right side over across the body to the left. Here we go. 40 seconds of work here. Fourth exercise, fourth, <laughs> fourth and final exercise for this first round here. Again, let's make sure that our hands are nice and straight, really focusing on from the bottom all the way up to the top. You should feel that stretch in your oblique. Your core is nice and activated, stabilizing with that one knee down. Nice, eight more seconds of work here. Squeeze that core, 
Squeeze those glutes, two, one, time. Awesome work, awesome work. First, first round, we learn it. Second round, we own it, okay? <laughs> All right, we have one minute of rest here. Again, if you're just joining us, grab some water, grab some comfortable clothes. We have three more rounds, which is just enough time for a great workout just as well, okay? 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest. Let us know where you're watching from. Let us know where you're joining from. Let us know where you're working out from. If you're indoors, like Sergeant Barry, or outdoors, but at home, like myself, uh, we are literally, I'm within six to seven feet of space. So we do not take up a lot of space on our Monday workouts. Uh, we push through, and again, it's all about the effort here. All about the effort. All right, five more seconds and split hops. Four. Three. All right, last rest. Okay, let's go. My left leg is up, my right leg is back, and I'm 40 seconds of work here. 20 seconds on one leg. Split, split hops here. So 10 more seconds here. We're focusing on a little bit of power movement here with that forward foot, that forward leg. All right, 20 seconds in. Let's go ahead and alternate. My right leg is forward. My left leg is back. Let's go at your own pace here. Let's hop as high as you can. That's comfortable for you. Five, four seconds left. Keep that core nice and tight, nice and engaged here. One and time. Kneeling weighted lifts. I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit of resistance this round. First round, I learned it. Okay, I have my trusty aqua hydrate water bottle here. I'm working in two, one, my left knee is down, my right leg is up, and I'm coming across the body here. There we go. Keep that chest nice and proud, tall, nice and proud here. Let's keep those arms as straight as we can. Again, from the left hip up to the right, top above our shoulders here. 13 more seconds of work here. That core should be on fire. Nice and engaged. Keep those glutes activated, stabilizing with all small muscle fibers. Two, one, and time. Good work. 20 seconds of rest, we've earned it. <laughs> All right, even though the temp has dropped a little bit, I'm still breaking the sweat here. Four seconds, three, high plank, high plank rows, starting now. Go ahead and adjust here. There we go. Again, nice and smooth, nice and controlled. If you need a little bit of, a little bit more stability, go ahead and take that wider foot stance. The wider, the more support you'll have. Let's try and keep those, that spine nice and straight, nice and neutral. Again, squeezing from your navel here. Eight more seconds here. Five, four, two, one, and time. Good work. <laughs> Good work. I'm going to stay down here. Stay down here on the ground. 10 more seconds of rest here. Catch your breath, towel off, grab some water, stay hydrated. <clears throat> All right, needing lifts. My right knee is down, my left leg is up. I have my weight and I'm working here. 40 seconds of work. There we go. Again, what's great about working against time is you can go at your own pace here. 40 seconds of work. Almost a reverse chop here from your right side all the way up, arms are straight to the left, up top. Five more seconds of work here. Three, two, one, time. Good work. Two rounds in the books. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Awesome, you guys. I, 
Bray, I wanted to take a second to just share um, Tom Dowd with Performance Inspired has tuned in and he says, um, hashtag inspired to be better. He's given you like a thumbs up emoji, clapping hearts um, and the arm flex. So and the arm flex. Good job, um, guys. <laughs> thank you so much for tuning in. We are inspiring to be better ourselves each and every day, each and every week. One small goal adds up to our large goal. We are inspiring to be better as well. Thank you, Tom, so much. 10 more seconds of rest here. We've earned it and we have split hops coming up next. Split hops, 20 seconds each leg. My left leg is forward, my right leg is back. And we are hopping here. Again, focusing on power, a little bit of drive through that front foot for 20 seconds on that front foot. Okay, again, use those arms. Use those arms to propel you up to the top. Grab a little bit more power for two seconds. One, and let's alternate here. My right leg is forward. My left leg is back. There we go. Let's hop as high as you can to your comfort level. Or just stand up here. Work on that lunge. Nice and smooth. Two, one, and time. 20 seconds of rest here. Good work, good work, Sergeant Barry. Good work, B-Fit Nation. Let's grab some resistance here. My left knee is down, my right knee is up in that half kneeling stance in three, two, one. All right, we're chopping here. Again, I'm down. My knees, <clears throat> my knees about 90 degrees here. My arms, I'm focusing on keeping them as straight as possible here. Again, really forward, forcing our body to counterbalance, to activate our core, our glutes, our whole posterior chain here. And your obliques should be on fire here, as well as your anterior delts. Five more seconds here, four, two, and time. 20 seconds of rest here, we've earned it. All right, body weight, body weight, high planks. In five, I'm down, body weight, high planks are here. Two, one, okay, let's work here. Let's try and keep that spine nice and long. Your back is flat, keep those hips nice and square. <clears throat> Your hand placement should be right under your shoulders here for the most support. And with all of that, you wanna focus on that top contraction of that row where that elbow is coming up close to your body. 10 more seconds of work here, let's hold it. Five more seconds here. Focus on your breathing. Hold that breath at the top and time. Good work, that one's not easy. 15 seconds of rest. <clears throat> All right, my right knee is down, my left knee is up and I'm working here. Weighted lifts here, again, across your body, forcing you to stabilize. <clears throat> Again, left knee is up, right knee is down. I'm coming from my left, lower, my lower right to my upper left. The slower, more controlled that you can go, the tougher it's going to be. Nice, 10 more seconds here. Finishing off round three, two, one. All right, good work. You've earned it, one minute rest. BFIT Nation, how are we doing? How are we hanging in? All right. 40 more seconds of rest here. <clears throat> I wanna know what's everyone doing to stay active? Are you working out at home? Are you able to get out for a run for that jog, for that Zumba class? Let's continue to push forward. 
Forward is forward. Progress is progress here. Good work, guys. 20 seconds of rest here. Catch your breath. Towel off. Grab that water. And just like Tom said, inspired to be better. Two, one, split hops coming up. Okay, my left leg is up. My right leg is back and I'm hopping. Again, to your comfort level, to your height, to your hop level, working on that power from that front leg, your quads, your glutes, your calves. All right, 20 seconds down. Let's alternate here. <clears throat> right leg is forward. Watch that balance here. Keep stabilizing. Use those arms to drive you higher. Power through that quad. Two, one, time. Good work. <laughs> All right, we're back to the needed, the needed, the kneeling. Let's get this right, Roy, kneeling, weighted lifts. My left knee is down, my right knee is up, and I'm working here. 40 seconds of work here. Again, from my lower left to my upper right. Take that nice power stance between your knee and your right foot. Focusing on driving up to that right side, keeping that core nice and tight, nice and engaged. You can feel that lower, that left leg down, feel it burning there in your glutes for stabilization. Five more seconds of work. Two, one, and time. Good work. Last set, best set. High plank rows, body weight, high plank rows in five. All right, here we go. My hands are shoulder width apart. My legs are shoulder width apart. Really focusing on keeping my back and my glutes down. Backs nice and long. Here we go. Keep rolling to your pace. Focusing on that squeeze up top. If you can, add in one second pauses to those rows. And if we need to come down to our knees here, let's regress for comfort. Keep pushing five, four, three. Elbows are nice and tucked and time. Good work. Not an easy one there. Good work, Sergeant Barry. Good work, BFIT Nation. Right knee is down. Left knee is up, last set, last round. Best set, best round. Let's work, 40 seconds here. Right knee is down, my left knee is up. I'm going from right down to left up. Again, utilizing that core for stabilization. Pushing those hips forward. You feel a good stretch in your in your hip flexors. Your shoulders are on fire. Keep pushing. Ten seconds here. Nice, good work. Keep those arms straight, nice and tight. Core engaged. Glutes engaged. Two, one, and time. <laughs> good work. Good work. Awesome work, Sergeant Very Awesome work, Beef Hit Nation. If you are just joining us, Sergeant Barry and I just completed four rounds of four different exercises here to round out a total body workout for 40 seconds of work and 20 seconds of rest. Again, what's great about each of these exercises here is that we incorporated some power movements. We incorporated some ISO holds holding in our core for strength and stability. Most of these exercises, we've activated our glutes 
and our full posterior chain from our glutes to our hamstrings, our calves, and our back. Stabilization, core work, everything that you need to build on your everyday workout. Your day is a workout, so great work, guys. Excellent, Roy. I really like to do the split um, pops. Got my heart rate up, so it was a nice balance of heart rate and stabilization. So absolutely. Awesome. Absolutely. Thank you so much. And that's, that's a great idea with programming. If you are programming yourself, if you have a high intensity exercise for your first exercise, go ahead and supplement that with a kneeling or something that isn't as uh, aerobic for you to kind of control that heart rate and really level you out through the exercise to keep you focused, to keep you in breath and in step with your next in uh, full workout coming up. So absolutely. Well, Roy, just want to thank you so much. And Sergeant Barry, thank you as well. And for everybody tuning in, we really appreciate you guys. Um, Roy, do you have anything else to share? Or if not, then I guess we will see you next week. Sure, Lee. I, again, I just want to thank everyone for tuning in. Again, thank you for including and, and being a part of our BeFit family here at The Exchange. Again, it's all about teamwork. It's all about what we can do together to build each other up, to get every one of us through whatever time we are dealing with and move forward. Each step forward is forward again. And if we can move forward together, we will, again, accomplish greater things. So, Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for watching. Fantastic. Thanks for all of your great work, your words of encouragement. I'm sure, we, you know, I appreciate it and I'm not even doing the work. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Great to it's see the, you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you, Sergeant Barry. Good work. Done for the, for the day. All right. Got your week started Great right. Great work. Way to start off the week strong. All right, you guys. Bye, everybody. Right. Bye.